ladies yes natural hair talk i guess she probably said this chick done lost her mind she ain't talking about her hair she's so busy playing in makeup she is going crazy but no 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 i just like so i'm just loving my hair being up in a bun i'm not touching it remember i told you guys that i had some issues up in here from wearing my hair up in a puff and i'm seeing so much progress even more so now that i'm not touching it like when i took my bun down last week and I washed my hair well I co-washed it and well I did wash I had all this gel in my hair so I washed it just once then I co-washed it twice so I'm seeing that it's really really getting thick in that area and it's just growing there's no more bald spots so I'm really really happy about that so I'm loving the protective styles I want to do I want to revisit the perm rocks I never succeeded with doing the perm rocks but I'm really, really loving this. I like it. And I really want to put my hair up. I really want to either get a sew-in or I want to get the Havana twist. I I'm thinking I'm going to do the Havana twist myself. Because let me tell you, I went to the braid place. And I asked the lady, you know, how much do they cost? And she said, oh, if you bring your own hair, it's going to be 140 And if, no, yeah, and if not, it's 180 And I was like, okay, I see a hundred women on here that do these Havana twists themselves, I can go buy the hair and just get a bottle of wine and just sit back and do these twists pretty much myself. So I think I'm going to try that. If not, I'm going to get a sewing. And I will tell you up front, I've thought about it. I said, oh, I'm going to get me a nice kinky curly sewing or whatever. Negative. If I don't want to deal with my own hair and detangle and do all that stuff, I'm not going to go in and get a kinky weave and I gotta sit and detangle that and treat it just like it's mine. That defeats purpose. I might just deal with my own hair. So if I do get a sewing, it will definitely be probably something on a body wave or a straight or something of that nature. Because if it's straight, I'm gonna wear it straight. And if it's a body wave, I would just probably flexi rod it or something of that nature. Because my thing is if I'm gonna deal with my hair, I'd rather just deal with my hair. I'm not going to, I would get a sewing for the convenience of it not being so much work. Yes, sewings can be work because I remember, you know, three, four years ago when I used to wear, you know, sewings and things like that. You know, it could be work, but I would definitely do something that would be more of a, maybe a bob and it would just pretty much stay in that style and it would be a wrapping situation. Or if I do get something long, again, flexi rod in it where I'm not really dealing with it because... I'm liking where my hair is growing. I'm liking the way everything is like for my second big chop. And I don't want to ruin that for me tugging and pulling in my hair. Right now, I am I mean, with just life going on, sometimes the least thing you want to worry about is your hair. You just want to make sure it's in a situation to where you don't have to deal with it. So that's where I'm pretty much at right now. That's why I'm loving this. It's still natural. It still looks good. You know, I, got, I get a lot of compliments, you know, on this bun. You know, so, but I don't want to wear it out. I don't want to wear it to the point where I'm, I'm wearing it out and it's not compliment anymore. But I like the neatness of it because, again, I get compliments. But I do want to do something different. So that's probably, that's not probably, that is the reason why I'm not, I haven't done a natural hair talk. And I haven't done a natural hair video because I'm just want to leave it alone and let it rest. Sometimes when you just tug and tug and tug in it, you're just doing unnecessary breaking. breaking. And so I don't want that. But I may revisit the perm rods. I may, I may not. I strongly doubt it. I'm, I think I want to wait till my hair gets a little bit longer so I can have more of the hair coming in my face. Even though my hair in the front is right here, when it gets wet and everything, it shrinks up and it, and it stops right here. So that defeats the purpose of what I want to do. I really want to do the perm rods and I want to have my hair pretty much in a faux hawk. But I want the hair to come in my face. So that's going to, I'm going to have to let my hair grow a little bit more. Maybe by the top of the year, I may be able to achieve that. But who knows? But I'm thinking more at the end of the month. Either I'm going to sit down with a bottle of wine, about 10 packs of hair, and do my Havana twist myself. Or I'm going to go get a sewing. So I hope me getting a sewing, if it's straight, if it's a bob, if it's, it won't be kinky. Trust me, because I'm not going to sit back. And pull and tug on a sewing where I'm, I have braids in my head, it's sewn in, and I'm tugging on that to tug on weave. I'm not doing that. So I hope that doesn't bother any of you. I hope 
you know, I don't lose any subscribers behind that because, you know, I know most of you ladies do watch me for my natural hair. So, I hope that you don't. But um, I just want to let you guys know that this is what I've been thinking about. And if you have any suggestions for me, please leave them below and let me know because, you know, I really, I mean, I'm sure you ladies been there before where you want to, like, just put it, like, put your hair to rest for a while. Just leave it alone and just let it do its thing. I don't want to wear a wig. I don't want to do that. You know, if I had a, a wig that somebody made for me, maybe. Right now, I'm not confident to make a curly wig or nothing like that. If somebody made one for me, I would wear it because I know that it's done right. But me, personally, I don't have enough confidence to make myself an actual wig. I don't, I don't know. But I'll sit down and I will, um, I'll try to put the answer to it. I don't really want to, but I think I can do it. I think so. I tried with this hair because, you know, I didn't use the whole pack. I had parted a little corner here and I did it and it came out really nice so I think I can do it I'm sure if I can't do the whole thing I just do the perimeter and just leave it up and the rest be just corn rolled or something but I'm definitely gonna try but you know again leave me your comments let me know below you know if you're not subscribed subscribe and please rate let me know thumbs up if you like my videos okay I'll talk to you guys later. And don't forget, I do have a giveaway going on right now. I'm going to link it down below. It's for a Sephora palette and an Urban Decay palette. You must be a subscriber and you must follow my blog. And for a bonus, you can follow me on Instagram if you like. But I'm thinking I'm going to be a little lenient because a lot of people can't um, follow my blog for whatever reason. You can just follow me on Instagram. Because a lot of people use their phones to watch videos like I do because I, I watch them on videos on my phone. So that's that. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.